We've all pressed a few wrong buttons sometimes and permanently deleted a file that you were supposed to save. Thankfully, there are ways to recover it. My name is Yudullah, you're watching Candido Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can recover deleted files in Windows 11. Now when it comes to recovering permanently deleted files on Windows 11, you have two options. Uh, the first option is to use something uh, like Recuva which is a third party tool that you can use to recover deleted files for free. It's a tool from CCleaner. It's very easy to use. You just download it, go through the wizard and it will scan and find any deleted files on your drive. This doesn't work 100% of the time. And that's because once you delete files, there is uh, no sure short way of getting them back. But uh, if you want to use a third party software for this, Recuva is one of the best options out there. I'll put a link on the screen and in the description below. Option number two is to use a Microsoft tool that you can find on the Microsoft store. So let me just open up the store. We'll give it a second to load up. So the tool is called Windows File Recovery, which is going to search for it. And as you can see, uh, it's right here. Now, this is a command line tool. So there is no uh, sort of graphical user interface for this. So you will have to be a little careful with what you do. But regardless, uh, we can just click the get button right here to start the download and I will see you once it finishes. So now that I've downloaded the tool, let's go ahead and launch it. So Windows file recovery. It will ask for admin permissions. We'll give it that and the tool has launched. So the way this works is that you have to enter a quick command, uh, which says uh, WinFR. Then you have to enter the source drive, then the destination folder where the recovered file will go, and then the search mode, and then any specific filters or switches that you want. Here are some example commands given as well to help you out. So uh, I will be recovering this photographers.pdf file that I'm going to go ahead and delete by pressing shift plus delete. Uh, click yes, and now I can start up the tool again. So uh, the command for this specific query would be winfr and then I have to provide the source drive. So source drive can be, uh, you can either enter the entire uh, sort of path for your file or you can just enter the source drive, which in this case is going to be C. Then the recovery destination. Uh, so I'm going to save it on my D drive under recovered files search mode is going to be regular and now i'm going to apply a filter to the search because i am only looking for pdf files so for example if i remove the path from it and i ask it to search the whole drive it may find files that i don't really need so i'm going to tell it to search for only pdf files so asterisk pdf if you want you can provide multiple options so as uh, in this command above it has provided pdf and jpegs so this command will only search for pdfs and jpegs mine is going to only search for pdfs so let's go ahead and press enter and as you can see the tool is running and looking for the file so this is the confirmation of everything continue yes and now it's scanning and processing the disk. So let's just give it some time and see if it can recover our file. Okay, so uh, as you can see, it did not find any recoverable files with this mode. So let's go back and try the extensive mode to see if that throws up something. Press enter, it will ask the search prompts. We'll go ahead and click yes. It will scan the disk again. This will take longer and uh, as is the case with all deletable, uh, permanently deleted files, there is no guarantee that you may be able to recover them. Uh, it depends on how soon you've deleted them, where they were located and so on and so forth. So it's not a sure shot, but this is the one of the best possible tools because it's built by Windows and it's available in-house. Uh, so as you can see, our extensive scan is complete and uh, we have some results here. 
so it actually found uh, eight pdf files i'm not sure if these are the right files but we'll go ahead and take a look so it's asking if i want to view recovered files press yes and it will open up this folder and if i open pdf uh, these are the eight pdf files that it found and that's how you can use this tool to recover your deleted files on windows if you like these videos consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below if you have any thoughts on these videos or if you'd like us to cover anything specific if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and we'll see you in the next video